this fall. <laughs> A storm is coming. And it's conclusion. <laughs> Can't wait. <laughs> Absolutely. Ted? Ted, where'd you go? Ted, come on, this isn't funny. Shocking. <laughs> Shitstone 5, Shit's Erection. Read it all. Silent scope? Wait, Silent. no. Silent room. Silent room, that's a good one. So this is the uh, this is the last E3 trailer the game had. The, just this movie is just the last E3 trailer this game had? Yep. Uh, so we were talking to Liam about this game, so like, not ten minutes ago. Liam said something very underspoken, I'm not sure if you, if you realize it, but he's like, so what's the deal with this game? Is Tommy Wiseau in it? Yeah. I ignored what he said. I didn't. Um, That's and he asked creepy. me, hey, Pat, which game is better, this or Origins? And I was like, ah, this. And then I was like, no way to Origins. So I rented this when it was new, and I played it for a little while, and I was like, this is so fucking, why is this enemy floating through everything? Oh, God, what the fuck is this? This is weird. And the last Silent Hill game I had played up until that point had been two on a friend's Xbox. And I was like, what the fuck happened? This is not as good. And when Last Shit Storm, when we played um, Origins, I, I kind of dug Origins. It was a little weird, like you said, but... I've gotten every ending in every Silent Hill game, wow. but I've never finished this one. Wow, so people know. <laughs> right? Look at those cool enemies, though. Yeah, I remember Wooly once saw those enemies during the trailer, and it... it Scarred his soul. There's something about those two little face like gorilla people that freak yeah, him out. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't like it. Uh, this game that's is that's an area that's bullshit. This I game know is that. the water prison. Yeah, this yeah. game is troubled. Uh, depending on who you ask, this either was or was not started as a completely different game. Well, in the Did You Know Gaming episode we did about Silent Hill, I was shocked where I found like an actual interview. Where some of that info came from, an interview with like someone that that uh, Konami that's like, yeah, that was untrue. We had two teams, and and the second one's mandate was to really shake it up, but still to make a Silent Hill game. When when I when I spoke to Liam about this, I described that this is a game in which they really shook it up and they <laughs> threw tons of stuff at the wall, and not a single one of those stuck. concepts stuck. Yeah, like. like Ev like it's kind of shocking that everything they change was better the way it was before. You know, also even music's good. Yeah, music. Uh, you know, the music's great. You know, even when it still has a number in the title, the fact that it has a subtitle just lets you know that things might be different. Just a little different. Just yeah, little you know bit. all the you know all the options. I would like to change those, please. There you go. Or right, let's take a little bit of adventure into Henry Townsend. Ash Ash Ashfield? Into Ashfield, yeah. Yeah. So the biggest Silent coolest Hill. part about Silent Hill 4 was in Silent Hill 1 and 2, you're like, you're going to Silent Hill. In Silent Hill 1, you're going to Silent Hill. Silent Hill 2, you're going to a different part of Silent Hill. Silent Hill 3, you're not even in Silent Hill, but maybe you'll go there. <laughs> and Silent Hill 4 is like, it has nothing to do with Silent, Silent Hill. Hill really. You don't go to Silent Hill. But you actually do. Sort of, through portals in your bathroom. Yeah. Easy. Yeah, we need to get through as much as we can. Easy for bitch mode. Yeah. Because we don't have. Because there's card. invisible fucking enemies that are that float through everything and can't be killed. So, oh, so many things about this game, but I'll I'll have time to to shit on it in a bit. Yeah. Okay. Good. So Henry Townshend. That's the, a terrible in, last in name. In the in the original like uh, stuff, I remember it was Henry Townsend. It's so much. And better. I think they changed it to Townshend to make it like less obvious. Yeah. That, like, I suppose. Something strange happened. 
I had this horrible recurring nightmare. I can't leave re room Liam the Liam Liam, 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 two. Liam room Liam room two. Fourteen oh six. 1408, sorry. So, in the precursor to all the horror games that would blow up the internet in the future, large portions of this game are in first person. When you're in the room. Yes. I forgot about that. You forgot that the room... Now, I, I, I remember the room having weird things where there's, like, actual, like, scary stuff happening in your room uh, called well, hauntings. Occasionally. Like to... Now, hold on, Matt. You kill time while I draw the blinds. Oh, I was going to say, there's some reflections on that... You know, perfectly calibrated TV. I'm going to walk around. I'm going to Silent Hill it up. That was a little on the nose. There was a Wilhelm scream right there. Or it sounded like one. Uh. Pat just bumped into everything and destroyed the channel. <laughs> okay. It's, it's, it's really dark here. I'm going to look at this. What's with this room? <laughs> That's it? It's covered in blood and rust. So very classic, right? I might be in Ashfield. Who knows? <sighs> all right. Thanks, man. This is my room, but what the hell happened to it? It became all poopy and crappy. I don't like that. I don't like that it became very poopy. Uh, so uh, a bit of a spoiler because we're never going to play this game again. Yeah. Um, like guaranteed. Fuck yeah, man, this piece yeah, of shit. Guaranteed. Um, Fucking played. Halfway through the game... Down the room there. goes from being a friendly, nice place to this shithole nightmare zone. And this is like a nightmare we're in right now, I think, yeah. because we're not all... Oh. Is it really my room? I mean, did I, did I not pay my rent? Why does it look like this now? Oh. No. Oh. Did I let that man stay with me? That woolly man? See, you know, you're just, you're, you're on the nosing it. Oh, my head hurts. Whoa. Oh. The sound of all those Street Fighter tournaments playing in the background. So this is a little interesting right here. It's cracking all. It looks like a face. It does. It's almost like it actually is it's just a face. It's creepier that it's the side, it's the profile, yeah. rather than like a straight on face. Yeah, what's going on? Where did this big TV? I don't own a good TV. I had a record player. That's, That's the weirdest. Oh, this is oh, right. Oh, no. This is some media savvy person's apartment, not mine. I would never have a good apartment. I would never put that creepy face. Who installs a face? Who would do this? I like it. Oh. I'm afraid. I'm very afraid to open it up. Hold <laughs> on, let's go hide in the closet. Damn it. Closet. It's shut tight. You have a lot of options. Yeah, I'm trying to find the thing that'll, that'll trigger this for. That door is shut for good. Oh, right, you can strafe for some reason. Yeah, you know, strafing uh -oh. for combat in first person. Rot row. Now, you can probably tell uh, viewers at home, but uh, for a PS2 game in first person, this looks amazing. It's pretty good. Like, uh, all of my problem with this game revolve around its gameplay and its controls, but the looks and the sounds are awesome. Yeah. Check out this dude crawling out of a wall and being really gooey. That looks great. This isn't my apartment. Excuse me, sir. I don't think you live here. This, this is... Mm. Now, to be fair, though, in terms of Silent Hill, that's, that's just like a weird zombie. Yeah. Which is a little weird. Well, the, the, big, the big thematic twist they added to this game in terms of like... Design, I guess you would call it, is is it a ghosts? Not, it's not really about Henry at all, really. Yeah, it has uh, Henry's totally immaterial. Yeah, has, it's, it's he, more about like a he serial has absolutely killer or nothing something. to do. It's is about it Walter not? Sullivan. Yeah, um, and this this game has like one of those those. <sighs> there's a, there's a problem with this game's plot. Uh, it, I personally think it's pretty cool. It's a little harder to follow than some of the other ones. Wow, but it's interesting. That's saying a lot, and it's it's one of the personal stories, like two. But my problem with it is that it's how do I put this? You know when you know when there's a side character like uh, that guy in Heroes that stops time, sure, and he he plays a minor role, sure, 
And then they're like, by the way, we're coming out with his new series because he was actually doing tons of shit all the time. Right, right. Um, if if you uh, if you folks at home watched our Silent Hill 2 LP, and you should, it's good. I'm proud of it. Um, it's all right. There's a bit when you're in the apartment building early in the game where you read an article talking about a guy yeah, who killed two kids yeah, named Walter yeah, Sullivan. And, uh-oh. Game did a weird resolution switch. It sure did. What a bastard. Anyway, Walter oh, Sullivan uh, is like, oh, I killed those kids. The red, the red pyramid made me do it. And then they him. and then they oh. they go on to make him like the primary antagonist of this game, and they it's like they like retcon that to be part of a much larger plot. Right. And it's like, mm. but yeah, Walter Sullivan is like just a hero <laughs> for all intents and purposes. A big hero. Yeah. <laughs> big hero Walter. <laughs> Celebrated. I'm trying I, to. I, need I didn't a, choose to do that, by the way. The game forced I me. I need a. I need f order food. Hello? Food? <laughs> I need you. Henry needs food badly. badly. <laughs> My phone's still not working. Darn. This My game, this, is This terrible. game also, like, dives really hard into the Silent Hill, like, technological uh, nihilist, like, place where it's like, ha everyone has old phones and old televisions, right. but some of the tech is kind of out of paste, and it's like, ah... I always like him that all the tech in the buildings are kind of outdated, but the people aren't. Yeah. He's dressed stylishly enough. Help me. What? <gasps> but my phone's disconnected. That's fucked. I should get some food. Henry needs food badly. How could I talk on a magic phone? So, his apartment is super detailed. I love it. Yeah, no, because, like, it had to be, right? If, like, you spend a good chunk of the game... I can view the contents of my scrapbook. You haven't got anything, Nothing. loser. Nothing. You're a bad scrapbook man. It's a photo of a church I ran across while I was visiting Silent Hill. For some reason, I was really attracted. Hey. Uh, that's supposed to be the church in SH3, I think. So, he said he visited Silent Hill. Um... So is that like a thing, let's say, because all I know from this is like this game where it's like very tertiary, like uh, it doesn't really kind of happen in Silent Hill. But is it like the grudge where if you just take a whiff of the thing? No. And you kind of bring it back with you? No, no, no. But then, See, the Silent Hill is kind of confusing because every character, oh, yeah. every character that ever goes there encounters an empty nightmare hellscape. Right? Is this the room I just came out of? Yes. Weird. How do I get turned around so easily? Because you're uh, talking. Yeah. Stop yeah, talking. I guess. <laughs> until, uh, until you get e to Everyone place. who ever goes to Silent Hill encounters an empty nightmare hellscape populated only by a few people who are clearly all fucked up and some monsters, right? Monsters. Um, and if between Silent Hill 1 and 2, it's the extra weirdest because there's talk about it being a resort town and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And, like, the town has clearly moved on from the events of Silent Hill 1. Yeah, no. Even though there's still no one there. Time heals wounds. Um, and the reality of it is is that uh, same thing in Downpour, same thing in all Homecoming, all oh, that stuff. Oh, yeah. Silent there's Hill a is a normal town to 99% of people. It is a completely average little uh, mountainside resort town with a lake and fishing and they never encounter anything whatever that being said the town is evil and will reach out to people uh, okay no back up back and grab and grab them to 99 percent of, of people though that go there yeah like you said yeah when they go there are there people at work yeah no it's, it's a completely average town but there's people that are living there just going yeah everything's great yeah everything's great Hey, look, it's some I, lady. You know what? I don't believe you. Well, I don't know what to tell you, because Henry visited it, and he didn't visit a fucking ghost town. But there's no one there except for, like, four people. No, because you get sucked into... Why are those two people naked? They're not. They look like they are. They're just wearing... They're just the same character model. They're naked. Um, Confirmed. Like, uh, uh, what's it called? A uh, uh, Mary... Uh, when when James had Mary in the hospital, yeah. she was in a regular hospital in Silent Hill. 
No, wait, she wasn't in Silent Hill at all. Sorry. Fucker. Um, sorry, that's a bad example. It is. When... Um, I'm waiting for your good one. Uh, there are people that talk about going to Silent Hill, and it's mentioned as a resort town, and people go there. It's a place that people go. No, I know it's a place that people go, but is it a functioning town? Yes, it is a functioning town. In Silent Hill 1, there's a bunch of uh, uh, news articles talking about how the drug problem there. Uh, there's a big drug problem with White <laughs> Claudia. Through the ritual of the oh, holy yeah. assumption, he built a world that exists in a place separate from the world of our Lord. More accurately, it is within, yet without the Lord's world. Unlike the world of our Lord, it is a world in extreme flux. Our Lord. Moving floors, odd creatures, a world only he can control. Lordy Lord. Anyone swallowed up by that world will live there for eternity, undying. They will haunt that realm as a spirit. Oh, How Lord. can our Lord forgive such an abomination? And then there's a bunch of damage shit. It's important to travel lightly in that world. He who carries too heavy a burden will regret it. So Henry's like, oh, I thought I threw this pamphlet from those Jehovah's Witnesses away and yet it keeps it, it, ending it up persists. in my apartment the chest could hold a lot, a lot of stuff. stuff so this is our inventory <laughs> so right away this is the single second worst part of the game the fact uh, that there's only one item box the fact that there's an item box and you have a highly limited inventory but the whole rest of the game is designed like a regular it's silent, silent hill, hill game. game right right and right. ammunition really takes fun. up one slot per bunch of ammo it's terrible <laughs> so if you carry like a handgun and 60 rounds that's five slots that's that's no that's a nightmare that is the 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 number one light image for all the marketing is just this super fucked up super door, and I think it's a really strong image. I it really is. Like it, it is. It is. I By mean, the hell, way, I think that's on the cover. It is. I wish that someone that's not me would do a fantastic LP of this game so that I could see all the cool shit in it and not have to play it. I think there is such a thing. Probably. Go watch Mr. G Star three two one. He did an LP of this game. Is that the guy who did the astounding homecoming thing with the choose your own adventure shit? No. He's this weird Australian Let's Player I watch who okay. gets really angry at Mortal Kombat games. It's hilarious. That's good. What's going on here? Don't go out, says Walter. Wait, why am I doing this now? No idea. Uh, but yeah, no, Silent Hill is a regular town. Now, peepholes are a great gimmick because peepholes are inherently scary. Because they're weird have, and fish-eyed and distorted. You can have lots of scares. Hey, Eileen. So, for example, because I'm in the room and she's not, and she's not in the magical zone or whatever the fuck you want to call it. The magic zone. I can see those handprints. But she, but she can't. can't. She's That's kind of what happens in Silent Hill. People, the the other world has had like a, a a rocky relationship in which people believe different games take place in whatever the other world doesn't exist or what have you. But what is important is that people do get sucked into some kind of horrifying alternate dimension. Okay. As part right. of Silent Hill, and that's the fog. Because there's three types of Silent Hill. There's the normal Silent Hill that totally exists. That's a normal town. There's the foggy Silent Hill, which implies that it, the town kind of brought you there for some reason, and that place sucks. And, and then, then there's, there's Rustville. Then there's uh, then there's Rustville. Ch Chain Town. Chain Town yeah. Rustville. Chain Town Rustville. So okay, then I have a question. I know it's not exactly canon, but since it's a good visual representation, this is why maybe it screws me up a bit. But because we play Silent Hill games like every you know one every year, every couple of year or something. In the Silent Hill, the first movie, mm. when um, Henry goes to find uh, his wife, it's a ghost town that has no one on the streets, yeah. and it has no fog and no nothing. But and it is a re completely real town. It is a completely town. real place, and he calls uh, calls out, and there's like no one around. He's like, "Oh shit!" Even though he's actually right there, yeah. and in the uh, in the uh, like foggy dimension, she's totally there. So that's that layer, and then yeah. there's the rust one. But I was always under the assumption that Silent Hill is a real physical place you can go to. Yeah. But it is a ghost town, and that no one lives there because it's all fucked up, and everyone's like, "This place yeah. is nuts." In in the Silent Hill games. That's it is true. a active working town. It's weird because they never show that. Not a single fucking time. So you can understand why it might not but, seem like but that. But like, 
you and you can go be a massive asshole at this point and go like, well, we're gonna discount anything from the American games because they don't care, right? Or whatever. Yeah. But Travis Brady is like the number one like piece of proof for that because Travis's dad went and stayed at that motel like every year he went trucking. This part's and, great. And Travis like regularly drives through Silent Hill. And like gets gas and shit. Okay. Right. Like it. It, it continues to exist. And like when uh, when uh, when uh, 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 what's his name from fucking uh, downcoming downpour. Um, Murphy. Murphy shows up there. They're all weirded out that Silent Hill is deserted mm. because it's supposed to be a real town. Um, and. Something similar happens, I think, in SH three, where they're they're driving to Silent Hill like it's no big deal, like all oh, the evils there. But like she gets to the hospital and she's baffled that no one's in the hospital. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Um, and like those are uh, uh, Mary and James used to spend their summers there. Isn't that the logo of the stupid cult? Yeah, it's the big cult logo. Okay. What was? What's your opinion on the dumb cult again? You don't uh, like them. I remember reading this fantastic breakdown. Uh, it might have been from the Twin Perfect. Oh, what are the, What's the name? Is it yeah, Twin Perfect? Whatever. Uh, the whatever. guys who did the real Silent Hill experience. Those yeah, guys. Yeah. Um, and basically, they described that like a lot of people think that Silent Hill is about alternate dimensions and personal misery or whatever. Uh, and then they broke it down game by game. It's like no, it's actually about an evil cult. Like the evil cult is not a side story that is limited to a couple games. Like every bad thing that ever happened in Silent Hill is a direct result of that cult with the one exception being Silent Hill 2. Okay. Because it has not, like, there's very few things to do with the cult in that, other than they fucked the place up really bad. Real bad. And to the point where it caused it. So right away, as a PS2 game, you can see that this game looks amazing. It looks This good. game looks, looks super good. good. Uh, and I'm gonna... Uh, I'm gonna equip my little little they thing should, here. They should put this on an HD version that I wish yeah. Konami would put out. So, uh, you, you see my health up there. Uh, so right away I hate that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because that's, that's not Silent Hill to be able to see your health. Silent and Hill's, plus, it's like a game looking. Yeah, thing. usually Silent Hill is HUDless, but the reason why they have to have that, first of all, check that out. That animation's not great. Uh, is that what they want? Is that so you can build up your melee attacks? Yeah. And have big ass melee attacks. See that build up? Uh, but what the, what the best way to hit is to just mash it out and stun lock enemies. So fuck that mechanic. Right. Also, uh, the game uses 2D controls. Uh, in that it has no tank controls. There's no tank controls. Okay. Uh, and so you can go. I don't know you if want. you can tell, but Henry's running animation is terrible. What do you mean? It's fine. You can think about how hard, like, James and Heather run. Like, in their respective games. And look at his, like, weak-ass little baby run. Oh, I thought uh, I thought his run was quite, like, impressive. It looks like he's skating on the floor. I hate his run. I hate it. I don't him. think it's that bad. That was my first bad impression with the game, honestly. Fair enough. Where, um, I got there and I couldn't run. Also, if I remember correctly, this game doesn't have a flashlight. Uh, that's for <laughs> sure. I think I know that part. And because I'm, I'm thinking about it, it's like, why don't I have a flashlight? It's like, Mamacita. What's your yeah, name? pretty much. She reminds me of the sexy look that the girl gets in Henry. Shattered Memories, the one that you meet at the yeah. in the school uh, stage. Yeah. <laughs> this is my dream, and you don't even know my name. It's Cynthia. There's Cynthia. Your dream. Can I touch your boobies? I think this is also probably, <laughs> for me, the least memorable really Silent Hill too. protagonist, Henry. Oh. Henry? It's, it's because he so has this is a dream, huh? nothing to do with anything. Well, like, he is a dream, bystander in a, in a larger yeah, story. Yeah, that, because I already knew that going in, but also, like, just physically and, like, voice-wise, it's like, yet. Silent Hill 2 is memorable because it has this memorable voice actor that delivered so stuff in a very uh, weird way. Weird way. And Silent Hill 1, it's like, it's still like a blonde looking guy, so he kind of goes in the same thing. And, even, and, and even, Heather's amazing. Even Murphy is like, I'll remember Murphy, and although I forget his name. Honestly, Mur honestly Murphy home. looks a lot like Henry, but he's more interesting because he talks more and he's more active. Yeah. Uh, the guy, whatever, in, in how home poor. Home poor? Alex Shepard? <laughs> Alex Shepard. I'll remember him because he's he's like an army guy that does sick combos. 
Except he's not. Except he's not what? He's not an army guy. Alex Shepard? Yeah. He went to the army. No, don't you remember the whole no, thing? No, I don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> the whole thing is that he didn't go to the army. Yeah, yeah I forgot. That was the whole thing. Well, he did combos. So he did we're big, gonna... big, sick, sick combo. <laughs> Toilet! Toilet time. Wait this a is minute. important. I have to go to the toilet. I think I'm gonna puke. Like Henry, Henry is like the purest fish out of water. What? And, and there's a lot of value to that. What's going on? Because like, and, and he's the he's the fish out of water constantly because he keeps getting juggled between like various pure nightmare dimensions. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but like the game's level structure is really disjointed. Um, yeah, it really feels like they wanted to do stuff as wildly different as the apartment building and the water prison and stuff like that, and the the feel of the sorry the the country, without having yeah. to think about how those areas actually linked up. Right. You okay in there, Cynthia? That's not her. No. Why was there a jaguar noise? Cause I hate these enemies. These these are like my favorite of the dog types. Yeah, but they're annoying to fight in this game. Very annoying. They're my favorite of the dog types because of their incredibly creepy proboscises. Yeah, proboscis. Because they get hard like dicks, and then they drink blood out of them. Cool. See? I see it. That's fucking weird. It's weird, man. He's like, oh man, again? It, and also, in thinking up, like, stuff about, you know, Hey, Pat, how do you feel about the Silent Hill game? Um, see, I, my, my thing just got cancelled out. So instead, I'm just gonna mash it. Right, doing the power strike. Yeah. Really? What an amazing like, they, Why? like. There's more combat in this game. Why use a feline sound effect yeah. for a canine? Because it's I crazy, yo. Yeah. Um, I don't know what that enemy's about, because I didn't care to look it up. I I wouldn't even know. Yeah, I went to the ladies' bathroom because I'm a sicky. You have to be a huge, huge cow coward to be a pervert. Oh, you know what? I should go into the other bathroom first. No, a huge hero. Never mind. You just drop your fucking. Thing. No, I, I knocked over something. Yeah, this is the other bathroom. Yeah, that's where I want to be. Looks like no one's in there. Looks like no one's in there. Crap! Like no one's, no one's in, in here. What will I ever do? Uh, I feel like I feel like out. the lack of tank controls means they can't do camera angles as crazy as that as often. Yeah, yeah, you know what, you're kind of like, right. Like I still think the best camera angle in a Silent Hill game is the uh, the very beginning of Silent Hill One when you're going down that hallway and the camera swoops down Enter the and hole. then goes super high up and follows you I down remember. the hallway, that L hallway. I remember. I remember because that blew my ass off as a PS1 game. Because it was like, whoa! Like, that's the first dynamic camera movement I can remember in a video game. Because, mm. like, even Mario 64, they'd have you know, their pans and stuff like that, but, like, it wasn't, like, cool swooping and shit. Wouldn't there be a Metal Gear thing that would be similar, maybe? Nah, uh, yeah, probably. I can't. There's I can't, a lot of fast cuts and zooms with that. I can't think of one offhand. So I went through that hole in the wall. Ah, escaped. Also, there's no basis in my heart at all for the, in my mind, at, right, for this at all. This is pure headcanon of Pat, and I'm sure a lot of people came to this conclusion. This but part of the game, part of this game's like theme, sh is probably based around Insane. there was a hole here, but it's gone. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. Because no. he's able to go through holes into various parts of Silent Unfortunately, Hill. Unfortunately, that can only be your headcanon, because that only became a thing, like, well after this game. Well, yeah, bec well, also because, um, like, just like Walter Sullivan became a thing, the hole became a thing in this. Mm. Uh, but whether or not that's a direct reference, I I don't know. I tend to so that. I came back to the room and it heals me instantaneously to full. Okay. Which is really great. Uh, what's really not great is that at the end of the game, being in the room will hurt me. Over time. Also, there are items in this game, and this is the worst. You cannot throw items at the on the ground, right? You can't, can't so just drop them. You can't just drop them. And there are there are cursed items that if you put them into the box, 
they will haunt your house super hard. Yeah, so this is what I've, I I saw a bit of where it's like in specific spots your your house will get spooky and you need to use incense stinks or candles candles. Yeah. Mom, why don't you wake shit. up? That's not for you. It's like your mail. And you have to like burn out the haunting. Yeah, but there are items that like if you pick up too many your house can become permanently haunted like hard. That seems like a random And it, it becomes dangerous to come back to the room. Like the room turns to shit eventually and it stops healing you and at some point it starts damaging you, but it can get a lot worse a lot faster if you fuck up with those uh those things. Right. The furniture's been moved. Huh, somebody Yeah, I guess I'll straighten, straighten it. that shit. This is very much like Pat. This is a Pat thing to How do. How dare this thing be out of line? Who who could have A gun. A gun. What do you think of it? I think it's a gun. Oh my god. Thank you. Easy to use gun. With stopping power. Very stopping. Ooh, Cosmo. The main power's off. Damn. So he he you know he bangs on the windows. He can't break the glass. It's magical. Just fucking shoot it. Just fucking shoot the glass. Shoot the gloss. <laughs> uh this is a cool little rear window. Kind of thing. I like this part of it. Yeah. So that ho that is a level, right mm -hmm. there. The hotel South Ashfield, like you can, and that building over there. The subway is a level, uh, and then there are two levels that take place in Silent Hill. You and know, if this place being called Asheville and being in like near Silent Hill mm -hmm. is a little on the nose. Uh, I love that you can see, and you can see that everyone else in your building is completely fine. And they're having a great time. And you're the only person having a problem. Yeah. But boy, are you having a big problem. Big problem. A big problem. Oh, this game upsets me, man. I was so excited. I was right in that, that fever fucking pitch of Silent Hill obsession. Would it have been better if it hadn't just been called Silent Like, it was, it was literally called, like, the scary door or the scary I guess. Because then you better. could say it was a perfect trilogy. Yeah. Wait, what? No. One, two, and three? Oh, one, two, and three. Of course. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. Those games are, like... Oh. Hey, you want to make some fucking noise about something, people on the internet? Fucking make some noise and get Silent Hill 2 and 3 added to PS2 Classics. Yeah, instead of having to... Instead of having that fucking shit show HD collection. That still never really got fully fixed. Oh, never. The what? It was the PS3 version got one patch that fixed some things, but they're still... All, it's not great. Oh, I guess I have to continue forward. Yeah, I think so. Darn. I remember the... I vaguely remember um, a particular thing that's supposed to be happening with her, but I don't... Yeah, I also that. vaguely remember that. I ho oh, oh, the camera. Is that where I came from? Uh, yeah. yeah it is. Yes, it is. I don't have a map, unfortunately. Yes, you do. Oh. Giant I forgot, map. this guy, he, he makes his own map. What a hero. Why didn't... James and Heather and Harry because they're not smart like uh, Henry. make their own damn map. That's a turnstile. That's an office. Also, I really don't like the control, like the button layout. Like a uh, circle is the run. Can you not switch it? No. No. Uh oh. That that was a good hit though. So very. The dog earned that. Very unlike Silent Hill. It the best thing to do is kill these enemies. Yeah, you love that. So yeah, just keep going. Don't stop. Yeah. Tire yourself out. Look at me. That dog's gonna wait for you to get tired from over swinging. That's right. And then he'll just use his tongue dick to knock you over. Oh, no. Big hard tongue. Yeah, yeah, dog boy. Hit me. Oh, okay. You'll never get any of this, Henry Townshend. Uh, you know what I hate about you, Matt? I hate I, it. Yeah, what is that? I hate when you do it. Whenever I say something really embarrassing, yeah. something that can easily be spliced out of our video because it's quiet in the game, yeah. and I'm the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you immediately shut the fuck up so that people can get clean sound rips of my say? embarrassing shit. I said, yeah, dog boy with your heart. Oh, fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna tell you something, my friend. Oh. Wooly gave the best version of that ever. Yeah. And I also shut the fuck up. You bastard. And then I let Wooly know after like eight seconds. What is that? 
Oh, that's a thing. Don't worry about that. I let Willie know after eight seconds where I said out loud, hey, everyone, if you want to isolate what Willie just said, that's a good time. Yeah. Well, I'm not going to give any t context, but in a video from a few uh, weeks back, he said, yeah, don't worry. I'm going to suck it. I'm going to keep sucking it. I'll suck it. Yeah. That's all he said. Yeah, that's a big gross thing. That's what that is. Wasn't that like the fucking... Remember the big stupid tubes we had to take out of the final... The wheelchair guy from Downcoming? Yeah. I hated that part. The big flesh tubes? Yeah. Suck it Oh, right. For some reason, R, L, and L, like... Is this massive giant strafe, but only when you're aiming. It looks more like a dodge. Should be able to get to those streets. But I can't. You can't. Also, for some reason, R2 is the ready to attack button in this game. Well, that's not standard R1. in other games. Is it? Damn it, mm. I should be able to get out. But I can't. Well, I guess this was pointless. <laughs> it seems like it. I remember Maybe hit I, more I, Jaguar I, dogs. I remember what uh, what I have to actually do. But Seems I haven't like triggered that. the event that causes it yet. Uh, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to go back to Cynthia. Yeah. And then uh, she gives you like a coin. And then you can use it on the turnstiles. Um, but and, she was not in either bathroom. Yeah. Which is weird. Very, very odd. Try him again? No, nah, mate, you know, let's, let's, let's explore down the other way. Yeah, no, I was actually Let's be that sure. Maybe you're supposed to go back a bit to Look at this shit-ass run, seriously. Okay, you know what? Yeah, it's not great. I yeah. just, I just saw a bit of it where I'm like, you know what? It is kind of a little weird. It is kind of a little shit run. <laughs> little shit run for babies. It's, it's like he's favoring a certain leg, like he's trying to sell an injury. Yeah. No, boss, I re Oh, I hurt my leg. I hurt my leg. Oh, God. How many gym classes did I try to get out of? Oh, no. It's not because I'm lazy as fuck. No, I didn't want to hear what the other kids would say, so I didn't want to Oh, imagine. no. That's the true silent horror. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, that'd be my silent horror. It's just gym class. It's very close to Mr. Eddie. Yeah, well, a little bit. Nothing out here. Back to the bathroom. You'll never go up that, because that's impossible to go up an You'd never be able to down. go up there. You'd shred your insides out. Oh, dude. That's oh, really escalator-based deaths are horrific. Oh, yeah, I think... They're absolutely the fucking you've worst. you read a bunch of them. Yeah. I read about it. You submitted some to America's Funniest Home Videos. Yeah. Look at this toddler get shredded by an escalator. <laughs> Pranked. Pranked. <laughs> Pranked, bitch. You got pranked, kid. Now, reason dictates she's in here. Yeah, because it's the ladies' room. No. Now, you went through the little hole. Uh-huh. Maybe there's something on the sink you didn't trigger? I don't think anyone's in there. I feel like I'm no. missing something. Yeah, you... What a good like Silent Hill it. game. Uh, did you go to the turnstiles and activate it? Oh, works? shut up. I hate it when games do that. Maybe you only get the coin when you know you need a coin. Hey, man, I'm just spitballing here. Yeah, you just spitballing. That's fine. That's fine. You just spitballing. Ew. Luckily, I killed all the gross dogs. Yeah. The jaguar dogs. They're stupid mouth penises. Jaguar kick. <laughs> I was thinking that, too. Uh, Maybe the, the ticket booth. Uh, I need a coin to get through the turnstile. King Street line entrance. Uh. Alright, now go back to the bathroom. Fuck this game, man. And if that fails, I'll go back to the room and scope it out just a little bit more. You're tearing me apart, Henry. Damn, that's yeah. that's terrible. It's, it's real bad. Alright, let's try the men's oh, first. Yeah, you know what? Let's like like leave it the anticipation to the very end if that worked or not. It didn't. I know it didn't. But do you know when it would have worked is if when you looked at the turnstile there was a camera cut and it showed the turnstile and it zoomed in and said I need a Yeah, coin. but raw camera cuts are harder to do in this game because this is a free floating camera. And it has a free floating floating free floating camera. Free floating <laughs> You're into free floating to foodie booty. Got to get that scrimp, boy. Um, it has yeah, a free-floating camera in order to accommodate the new controls. 
It makes sense. So I think I might be able to get the coins here. Why do you say that? In the room. Because maybe I got some coins in the room. What is this? Uh, it's a fucking bullshit. Okay. Well. It's a fucking bullshit. It's a fucking well, well, bullshit. I tried to skip that, and I don't know if it worked. <laughs> Small items, but none of them are pretty interesting. Darn. I find none of the items in my bed. This, this is, is my, my bed. bed. <laughs> That's all it is. It's my bed in my house. I use this for sleeping, eating, and perhaps building a little fort. See, look. Stupid. It's a little order symbol. It's the order. Hey, you guys like the Remember order? Remember when Jon Snow helped destroy the order? No. Silent Hill Can I open my own? Go watch the second Can Silent I wash Hill my movie. clothes? You know, this is a room you've never seen. There are tools and things. It's my house. It's a clothes dryer. Get out of it's here. A washing machine. I'll never. Detergent. See, a hole opens up there at some point. Not now, though. Damn it, I'm super stupid. I completely forget to where to go. Look through the peephole again? Oh. Yeah, let's go look at the peepee. Don't go out. This is your... Landlord speaking. Don't do it. <laughs> I'll pee on you. <laughs> I'll raise your rent, fucker. Yeah. If I see you out. Yeah, you stay in that once. house. This is good. Chocolate milk. Mm, take it. Yeah, it's delicious. That's the best power up white wine. ever. Mix the two. Yeah, I got some bottle of white wine Chocolate now. Chocolate white wine. That sounds... Delicious. It probably is. Probably is very. Oh man, sure don't know what to do in this video. Oh, it's a save point I can't Maybe use. Maybe you needed to say. <laughs> Why oh, can't you? Oh, it's we don't true. have a fucking memory card because we're idiots. Is, yeah. and, uh, we lost mine. <laughs> Together we did. <laughs> okay. Oh god, that actually scared me. Yeah, th that seems like the reason why you would suddenly uh, change your mind. I've been told that there is a hole behind Henry's desk now that we can use. Okay. Now, where is this hole? IGN, you lied. Why did you lie to me, you bastards? They always lie. That's WWE 2K, whatever, is going to be great this year, everybody. No, Every it's year. Not. That seems like a good number. Damn. You should have pressed 737 uh, for uh, Pizza Pizza. A lot of small items in here. You might need to pause the game for you to look up. Oh, what? No, no, hold on. <laughs> no, I can do this. Yeah, but if it's... Where'd I get the gun? I got the gun behind the thing, right? Yeah. You got the gun behind... Yeah, exactly yeah. where you got it. Yeah. You're as sharp as ever. Let's get the gun. There, the, look for something look, that's Look, this is what I needed to do. I needed to read this. The faint hope I had is slowly changing to despair. I've somehow managed to tunnel this far. But no matter what I do, I can't get any farther. The hallway, the windows, the wall. It feels like this room is stuck in another dimension. Eileen never noticed. Eileen! This is the desk. Oh, it's not... That's a table. It's yeah, whatever. Desk. Fuck you, IGN. It's a side table. You fucking lied to me in your 14-year-old FAQ. Did this hole just fart? Yeah, it's farting fairly slowly. Like... <sighs> That's the. That's I bet you Plague would install such a thing. Yeah. Hey, Eileen. All right. What up, girl? We're I'm, I'm, I'm creeping. We're entering Liam mode. Yeah. Mm. Where did I put that damn broom? Darn. Mm. <laughs> Where did I put the planet cracker? Hey, you can see something from Silent Hill 3 in the background. I do. Yeah. I, see, I see the bunny. So that means. That she had to go to a normal Silent Hill to Mall, buy that. Or uh, the amusement park. Right. Uh, yeah. Uh, so we have a new name for uh, epic epic sounding dildo names. Mm -hmm. uh, the Crimson Dynamo. Oh, that's good. And then Liam came up with the old hunter. That's good. Oh, my phone is ringing. Yeah, pick up your telephone. You it's weird it when you go back to PS2 phone. games like this and you find that the games have actually incredibly specific and simple triggers for events. Yep, you're just supposed to look at a thing. Where did you go? I miss Hurry, you so. Save me. Feels like it's if been forever. Since you've been, oh. Oh, big token. I like how like it turned into a picture that was shit. Yeah. It's all pixelated and stuff. 
I need to get to my bathroom and climb through the big hole. Yeah. Big hole in my bathroom. It's a big problem. Yeah, it's where I throw my garbage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you just throw right out the window onto the street. I think that's one of my favorite things ever. Throwing garbage out the window? <laughs> So fucking lazy and inconsiderate. <laughs> like, like really? Like it's worse than like a oh Jesus. Hey girl, you look great. Why are you some like, kind of mannequin? But it's got a coin. Why are you like a Ric Flair mummy? I would like to take that coin. I need that to go to Lynch Street. Yep. Lynch Street, you know, of course, uh, keeping up the tradition of naming your streets and shit mm -hmm. after uh, horror uh, horror people. Horror people. That's very... Uh, yeah. It's, it's, yeah. There's a lot of Bachman Roads in that town. A lot of King Roads. Yeah. A lot of Stephen Roads. You they just, like Stephen King, that's what I'm saying here. You see Stephen King made a tweet where it's like, you should vote for Trump because he's probably Cthulhu and that's awesome. I need more book material. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he needs more book material. I need it. Guys. Guys. Guys, give me books. I'm trying to we use... Go, no, we need it to go to Lynch Street. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay, here King we go. King Street is not... That's not correct. I can't use this here. You gotta use it somewhere. Oh. There you go. Don't use it at the thing to put coins in. <laughs> yeah, use it at the... Just <laughs> shove it on the turnstile. Just use it at the door. Yeah. You stupid fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of the cool things about this game is that it does imply a canonical ending to Silent Hill 2. Hmm. Uh, it, Im it implies that uh, Silent Hill 2's in-water ending is the cannon one. What's not scary is entering Oh, hey, hey, yeah. Ghostman. And then, like, a badly compressed oh. FMV kind of just triggers, shows a vague thing, and then goes back to game. Like, why isn't it in <sighs> engine? I thought most things were. I don't know, man. It's it's just not as effective. Yeah. She's like, help me, and I'm like, no. Nah. Quickly, shoot the glass. I will shoot this glass. Damn, this door won't open. I can't get it going at all. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. We gotta, we gotta get her out of there. It's that ghost, I bet. And it, and this fucking ghost has this annoying fucking staticky noise of falling. So it. the ghost is so there. Okay, so the ghost is the third worst gameplay decision in the game. Ooh. Okay, so the worst by far. By far is the entire second half of the game is an escort right, mission. You're, you're talking there is about no. That is the worst. Oh my god. Um, the second worst is the inventory, right? Being limited in that way, which is ironic because I actually really like that in a lot of other games. Um, and the third worst is these ghost enemies. The ghost enemies are fucking terrible. Yeah, this they clip they, they can they 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 can they they can ignore geometry. Ah, 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 it's a monster. I tried to shoot her. <laughs> they, they damage you by existing near your character. Right, right, right. Um, and you can... What the? Look at it shaking its ass. Oh, it's a different ghost. Yeah, it's like an old lady ghost. Or yeah, something. they damage tell. you just by existing near 18 you. 18 or something. Uh, I'm going to be honest. From when I rented it, I wandered around this and just never got past that part. Yeah, well... And so, like, you can shoot the ghost and he'll fall down. But that doesn't kill him. I don't remember this area having this many ghosts, honestly. I certainly don't. So, he's sucking on your nipples, yeah. apparently. Uh, everything about these ghosts is infuriating and shitty. <laughs> yeah. I hate it. I hate that. It's I, great. So, I hate it and I hate them. You hate them too? Yeah, I hate them. The ghosts hate you as well. Yeah. And they're coming through here. What on the? What you carrying on? You come ghosts. on, run you, run you bastard! Jesus. Yeah. You gotta go through the hole. You gotta go through the hole. Oh, I missed something. Whatever. It's too late now. No, it's not too late. It'll oh, never be too late. Fuck. It's this thing. It's, it's locked, locked, and I and can't, you can't open do it. Anything with it, you idiot. It has a thousand eights written on it. You'll never get enough of thousand eights. I don't know. But yeah. Um So she's cool with all of this. She's like, yeah. Yeah. This is about what I thought was gonna be I'm gonna be doing on a Saturday night. Yeah, Saturday day, really, actually? Saturday day, sure. Yeah. It feels like it's night in here, to be fair. So yeah, they give you these characters 
and you have to protect them, and it sucks. It's just really bad that you have to protect them. You have to He's protect coming. them for these ghosts that you guys you, you can only avoid by running your ass off in these tiny areas. You know, that, that makes me think of Silent Hill. Fucking running my ass off in tiny, tiny areas to avoid ghosts <laughs> that can clip through fucking walls. Yeah, no. It's, I just it's, end up going back the way I came. No, I didn't. Like, an enemy that can go through anything is, is kind of cool, but, like, at the same time, you need rules. And then if they, they, they can follow you through doors and clip through fucking... Everything. The, the, they can come through walls into different rooms, like Nemesis. And, and their fucking sound is like that goddamn sound that kept repeating at the end of Shadow of Mordor PS3. It, it's, it's supposed to be like, a, like look, oh, he's spooky It ghost. looks stupid there! Yeah, it also looks really stupid and not scary. Okay, but you know what? As as good of a time as we had and whatever as as classic it is, nothing will be as stupid as the bodies getting thrown over the railing in Silent Hill 2. That's pretty stupid. You're right. You're right. You're right. But that's that's, that's one dumb moment out of an entire. Oh yeah, look. And this, look, it's a spooky ghost. So she's stuck on the on the stairs. She can't. Did get I just out. end up coming back out the same way I was at? No. I, it's unclear because you're in a subway station, so no, it's a different area system. somehow. So yeah, now. I did it. This door's open. How wonderful! I really like the. There's there's two subway sections I like. I really like the subway. Oh, there's three really. I like the subway sections in No More Heroes. I like the subway sections in Disaster uh, Day of Crisis, and I love the subway sections in Max Payne. So this this part in this case room. You guys are wondering. This is the room. Yes. Where you discover in the second half of the game that the game is terrible. Oh shit! Because Eileen is joins you in the second half of the game. Yep. And you have to constantly go up and down this ladder through the different floors to do stuff, and she cannot climb or descend the ladder. And Great. it is infuriating. It is the worst. Great. Uh. So um. Yeah. I guess we should leave it here because the game sucks. <laughs> But you know what? There's other Silent Hill games that don't suck. And maybe... We'll I, there's, there are sh more shitty ones than there are good ones now. Yeah, but there's still one really good there one. There is a good one, I guess. Maybe we're going to be playing it soon. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe That's probably... Own. It's. Uh, we'll look forward to Way of Memories. Or whatever, <laughs> whatever that fucking game is called. No, it's called Silent Hill. Shitstorm 5. Shitsurrection. Rated R.